Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and another vlog. Um, just a little quick intro, I'm in Ballarat, it's Friday night and it is pouring rain. <laughs> I caught the train so I'm like trying to walk and find my accommodation. So I might touch base with you um, when I find it. But yeah, I'm so excited to be vlogging again because it's been a hot minute. Oh my gosh, also, just before I went on the train, 
I had to stop and get some new shoes to wear for the wedding tomorrow because all my shoes are like just done and I'm not even being dramatic because I am obsessed with shoes and I am the kind of person who would buy shoes that I don't need which I actually did do today which I'll show you but I desperately needed some shoes to wear for tomorrow because I only had like stilettos so the only black shoes I had um so I quickly ran into Novo and I found these for $30 they're so cute and it's at their house too so it's got this like a bit of a thicker platform so I won't sink into their garage so I love that for me um, but I literally was just thinking in my brain, like my feet, I have such like weird sensory issues in my feet sometimes, and now is one of those times. Um, and I was like, shit, I need to another change of shoes. Well, actually, I kind of did, because I made a silly impulse purchase today, and look what I got. Oh my god. They were $60, and I got them for 15 So, I might put these on, I hope that they let me go to the bar with them, but like, they're cute ones, so be their loss if they don't. Put them on and hopefully my feet will stop feeling pretty weird and let's get a beer or something. Okay, I can't believe I've exposed my toes like this because I am going to paint them tonight so just chill but look at my cute little shoes. Oh my god, I love them. I love. I walked outside for like two minutes and then um, I saw the sadness of Ballarat so I decided to just come back inside and get some Uber Eats. No offense if you like Ballarat, that's so fine. Oh my god, I actually want grilled. I haven't had grilled in so long. Oh my god, yum. Do I actually though or am I just, yeah I do, yeah I do. Yum. But I want something kind of cheap and grilled's expensive. Let's like, so can you sort by cheap? I don't actually order on Uber Eats that much. Picked for you. Most popular, let's go price range. I'm gonna click one, see how shit it is. Grill comes up awesome. I think I'm gonna um, water my food, quickly wash my hair because I have this wedding tomorrow. My hair is really bad, so I might do that. And then while my hair dries, I'll eat and then go live on TikTok. I think I haven't done that for a while, so yeah, I might do that. I also need to do a poo, but I'm so constipated, so I don't know if that's going to work, but it hurts kind of. It's really a bit too much information for not having been on my YouTube channel for like a month and then coming back and seeing stuff like that. Okay, I had a shower. I completely forgot to do my hair, so well, I mean, I didn't even bring anything to do with because I'm an idiot. So I'm a bit stressed about tomorrow because this is what we're working with for a wedding event, kind of. So anyway... But for now, I'm just going to eat my grilled. I got a Wagyu Wanda on panini with bacon, um, the natural crispy like HFC bites, and um, sweet potato chips with chipotle mayo. I'm going to go live on my TikTok while I eat it and then have an early night probably because I'm tired and stressed. Also, follow my TikTok down below so you know when I go live and stuff. Say hi to the vlog. Good morning, everyone. Just quickly touching base. I am about to go get my car um, and I checked last night like from the hotel what the Uber would be to the car yard and it was like 20 bucks so I was like sweet and I just checked this morning and it's $50 um, so I'm walking there and I'm just like refreshing the app as I'm going hoping that it goes cheaper because sis did not budget for that. Well, I think I said yesterday, like the trip to like the V-Line hotel and then like Uber slash taxi from the hotel to the car yard would have been cheaper than me driving down with a friend or something. Um, but with a $50 Uber, that does take it over my calculations and I'm going to refuse on that one. So I'm also just seeing a Coles here, so I might quickly run into Coles. Um, because I am obviously going straight to this wedding. And um, by the way, it's not a wedding. I'm just referring to it as a wedding, but they're already married. It's just like a wedding party plus a housewarming. So anyway, um, this is all I have in terms of hair and makeup to work with. So I might run into Coles and quickly see if I can get some like hairspray or maybe a new eyeshadow palette that's cheap or something that I can just like look a little bit nicer with. 
Um, and then hopefully after I've been in the supermarket for five or ten minutes, the fares may have gone down. Also, also, all my stuff is drenched. I'm wearing wet active wear. My jacket is drenched. Everything in my bag is fully drenched and smells like mildew. So my outfit for today is drenched. So I'm hoping on like the three hour, sorry, hoping on like the three hour drive back to where I gotta go. I'm gonna crank them heaters and we can get some stuff dry because wow. It's a 2020 Hyundai Kona. I'm not sure if I've said that. I don't have anywhere to put my camera um, in this car, but I have bought a mount that I can put in it. But just for now, you have to suffer and uh, look at my fingernails and the steering wheel. Also, do you guys like my fingernails? I want a bit like... Anyway. How do I put the window down? I've actually been driving for ages. I picked up the car at like nine o'clock and it's almost 11.30 and I freaking drove for like an hour in the wrong direction from Ballarat because I didn't want to touch my phone while I was driving, which I never do anyway, but like I didn't put my maps on before I left the dealership. So I was like, you know, I probably can figure out the way from here. No, I couldn't because I ended up driving back past the dealership an hour and 10 minutes later when I finally was on route. So yeah very not ideal I have this wedding is in like a couple of hours I'm stressed I look like this all my stuff is wet not a vibe and I still haven't had a coffee so I'm getting a coffee from Macca's now and then I'll keep hitting the road also I just posted a cute little Instagram story I'll show it to you guys go check me out on Insta Oh, hold on, it's actually my turn to order, so. Hey, you seen the buy Macca's app today? Yeah, I am. Yeah, what's the code on that one? It's PK37. Sorry, what was that one? PK37. Is it a mobile order? Yeah, it is. Um, oh, yep, yeah, Natasha. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, all good driving through. Thank you. Car is quite big compared to what I'm used to, so love going through a drive through on the first day you get a car. See you on TV any given Sunday. Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to show you. Um, I did a cute little Instagram story. Can you see? Um, and I put like them song gold digger on it because it's like see him on TV any given Sunday win the Super Bowl and drive off in a Hyundai shit yeah, anyway so that's like was basically my deciding factor for getting this car choking <laughs> wish I were um so I did a cute Instagram story go and hype me up guys we love to see it I'm so tired I should probably get folk like folk folk fake lashes for this thing today I'm gonna look so bad I don't even want to go at this point I'm so scared. That one's got um, sugar syrup in it, yeah? Great, thank you so much, have a good one. Wow, they gave me a dome lid, are you freaking joking me? I literally, for one, dome lids are fucking soft, and for two, I literally didn't even get um, whipped cream on my ice latte because I wanted there to definitely be no dome lid and I thought that it would be more likely to spill in my brand new car if I have a dome lid. So I was like, I'll just get a normal ice latte without a whipped cream. So I get the straight lid and they gave me a dome lid. Okay, so we've just gotten to our wedding party. Housewarming vibes. Oh, oh wow, Jo. Look how good you look. What is going on here?
morning everyone it's actually a monday i need to clean this mirror really badly um but i didn't film anything for you yesterday i actually moved houses and it was a pretty hectic day so um i didn't get a chance to film anything but i was thinking i'll just make this like a weekly vlog from friday to thursday see how we go i don't really have much planned for this week but i'm sure things will come up so yeah i'm just about to head off to work this is my outfit of the day it's just this dress that was originally from Sheen, but it was actually given to me by a friend, and I literally wear it all the time, so we love recycling fast fashion. This blazer is a linen blazer from Sports Girl. It was 20 bucks. And then my classic Novo leather print shoes that have been on sale there for the past four years. So if you want them, go get them. They're like 20 bucks, and they have been for a really long time. I think almost everyone I know has a pair. Wow, guys, it's literally a Tuesday night and I have not spoken to you since yesterday morning. Um, but I literally have done nothing, so please don't feel like you're missing out because you're not. I just had a shower. Why did I walk into this room? Oh, what did I do? Oh, I'm taking my hair out. Um, just had a shower um, and now I'm going to cook some dinner. I'm pretty not hungry. I haven't been hungry. For, I haven't had much of an appetite recently, which is not good. Um, but I'm going to make myself my salmon and rice bowl, which I used to make all the time. When I, then I stopped because I thought I was allergic to salmon, but I'm pretty sure I'm not because I haven't been eating salmon and I'm still sick. So, um, pretty sure it's not that. So I'm going to treat myself to that. <sighs> I'm sure that'll motivate you to want to eat something. So I'm going to make that. And yeah, it's pretty much me. God, sorry. Um, what else? Literally nothing to report. Okay, his dinner is served, but I don't have any cutlery or like cut crockery, so it's in the rice cooker with a disposable little, or not disposable, probably like a wooden spoon <laughs> fork. <laughs> Hi guys, happy Wednesday. Today has been the longest freaking day of my life. But I literally am so tired today i had work and um yeah it went forever but one of my work colleagues gave me some shoes how amazing is that they're brand new from witchery both of them and they just like didn't suit her so she gave them to me look at these first pair oh my goodness love and i'm also like in desperate need of shoes right now so these just came at a really good time i'm so grateful and then we have these like, these espadrilles. Look at them. And look at the way that they like cross over. You can't see because my hand's in the way. We love, I'm so happy. And like a navy gray color too, which is like, sometimes I've got another pair of espadrilles which are on their last legs and I might get rid of them now that I have those. But they're like black. And sometimes if I want to wear like a cute florally outfit to like a baby shower or something, like the black doesn't match, but the nudes espadrilles are also like I hate the way they look. No offense if you wear them, they probably look good on you, whatever. Um, so those I feel like a really nice colour. So that was amazing. Thank you so much. Um and now I'm at home and I'm trying to set up my internet and it's just absolutely not working. It's really stressing me out because like I have a modem, I have internet, I've called the internet provider, they've said I'm gonna get a drink, hold on. Anyway, they said it should be working. They said to just plug it in. I posted a thing on my Instagram today and I got the most replies to an Instagram that I've ever had in my entire life and everyone's like, just plug it in. But it's like not working. It's not working. I'm plugging it in and it's not working. I have to go onto the internet apparently and type in some like weird code to set up the internet to my internet but then it's not working and then I have a red light and then like I don't know like I don't know I don't know and I'm really confused why everyone it makes I feel angry because everyone around me is like it should be easy great why can't I do it I feel like I'm like getting a bit upset I don't even care about having the internet I just don't want my internet to like I'm paying for it but I, so I want to have no, it's like there and set up. Like I don't even need to use it. Like I'm not home ever at the moment. So like I'm not here to use the internet. Like, I can use my hotspot, whatever. But like it's the fact that I'm paying for a service and I'm not using it. I could probably use it because everyone's saying that it's really easy. So I'm just going to set it up and I can't. Anyway. 
I'm gonna go clean the bathroom. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's where I'm at. The Puss and Music on. I would ideally like to watch. I have like, they had this thing not for like years, but like growing up, probably got it from my mum. And then when I first moved out of home, whenever I cleaned, I would always watch like a concert video, like Mika or the Dixie Chicks or Keith Urban, like a concert performance, and have that playing. And that was kind of like my cleaning thing. And I would, I, I'd love to do that right now. Like I would love to watch a concert while I clean the bathroom. Haven't done that for five years, but I would love to do it right now. And I can't because I don't have any internet. So I'm going to have to use YouTube. I was yours for the taking. Guess I needed a home. But if I'm not mistaken, you were good on your own. Oh, and I know, and I know I was drunk enough. Didn't know, didn't know it would mess me up. Yeah. Okay, internet update. One of my friends came over and they fixed it for me. But like, to confirm, it actually like was not working very well. And it took a really long time to do. So it wasn't just me being like unable. It was actually like very hard to do. So that's the thing. I feel heaps better now. Like I said, I didn't even like need the internet. I just hated the fact that like, I was paying for it and it wasn't working and like I couldn't get it to work. That was just like really annoying for me. I just also got this new clothes horse yesterday from Kmart. Um, why does it feel so hard to... Oh, I don't know. Oh, cool. Okay, it's a bit uneven, but that's fine. Um, so tomorrow I have work again. Love that for me. Um, it's... Thursday, literally right now, feel as though, like, I cannot see myself going to work tomorrow, but I obviously will, but, like, I'm just not in the mood. <laughs> um, but after work, I'm so excited because I'm going to see my best friend in the whole world, Nicola. We're going to get dinner on Ligon Street, and that's going to be so nice to see her. I feel like it's just been way too long. We used to see each other, like, every day. And now I haven't seen her for ages, but it'll be good. Um, did I fucking, oh my God. I put all of these in the dryer. Wait, fuck, are you kidding me? Am I stupid? I didn't even wash these. I just put them in the dryer. So now they've been dried but not washed. I wouldn't even put these colors in the dryer in the first place. Today has been hectic, man. What the fuck? I'm such a fucking idiot. Damn it. All right, well, I'm gonna put these in the washing machine and uh, go have a quick shower, go to sleep. Tomorrow is gonna be the last day of the vlog too, um, which is probably for good reason because I feel like this vlog has been such a shambles. But I'm so excited to put it out for you guys. Because, wow, this is just not a vibe. I also need to pick my outfit for tomorrow. Shit. Look at the stars. Actually, I'm going to put this blazer in there too. Oh my god, why is my blazer pink? It hasn't even been in the wash. What is going on? Okay, hopefully that comes out because that's annoying. Wow. Today has not been a vibe. But I'm actually so excited that I was able to see Michael, my friend that came over to do the internet because I really missed him. Um, yeah, all right. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Mwah! Oh, good morning, everyone. It's Thursday. It's the last day of the vlog. And it's so cold. It's like 14 degrees for the high today. So um, I have like three jackets on. I'm freaking freezing. Oh my goodness. Um, I'm on my way to work. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I woke up later today, which is like not a vibe, but I'm literally starving and I haven't been eating until like one or two recently just because I haven't been hungry, but I'm starving today. So I found in my fridge this little ice long black because I didn't have time to make one. 
and I'm absolutely gonna nibble on this Kit Kat at seven in the morning. Love that for me. All right, I've gotta go. I'll speak to you guys later. Okay guys, I just got home. <clears throat> Pardon me. <laughs> oh, wow. I just got home from dinner with Nicola. We went to Tiamo in Ligon Street and it was actually so delicious. I actually don't even think I asked Nicola how her meal was, so that's a bit rude of me, but my food was delicious. Um, then we went for a little wander around Ligon Street, popped into readings, and then yeah, I've come home. I'm gonna blow to my hair and go to sleep. And I think I'm gonna wrap up this vlog here and try and start another one from tomorrow until next Thursday, maybe see if that's a better suit for me. Um, but anyway, sorry this vlog was probably like all over the shop because it literally was all over the shop. But thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, please don't forget to give it a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Love you.